I'm Richard Clark. In this video, I offer comments on Ramana Maharshi's 40 verses on reality, drawn from years of practice. Together, we explore the depths of Ramana's teachings on self-realization and liberation. This week's reading from 40 verses on reality we're on the second part of the invocation. These are Ramana's words. Those who know intense fear of death seek refuge only at the feet of the Lord, who knows neither birth nor death. Dead to themselves and their possessions, can the thought of death occur to them again? Deathless are they. This shows the basis for Ramana's own realization, which started when he reached, searched within himself for the answer to life and death at the age of 14. He found within himself something which never dies, which was his deepest identity. He was free, free from old ideas, free from gain and loss, free of all possessions, free of the body and the ego. Who dies? The body is born and so must die. Within us as our very self is the existence and consciousness that lights up our mind, our senses and our body. Does existence ever die? Consciousness? Do you die? This body dies. Are you the body? This is worth inquiring into again and again. Ramana said that for most of us, the misidentification with the body is the primary misidentification. Resolve this and you are most of the way home. When you know yourself as this unlimited existence consciousness, then of what lasting value is any transient thing? What you have and are is always. You know that you were never born and so will never die. Now some notes for practice. Do you exist? How do you know this except by your own inner light? Where does this light come from? This is a good inquiry. Who knows this? Knowing this you find something, not a thing, but consciousness, vast and without boundary. You find your existence, your being, without any individual. It is consciousness being or awareness existence. Being and consciousness are not two separate things, but aspects of one thing that is indivisible. Can you ever find one without the other? Look within and see for yourself. 
Does this existence ever die? If this is your own nature, do you die? This knowledge leads to freedom and peace. How can you want anything particular since you are vast and partless? No separation means that there is no other thing to want. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this Ramana Maharshi video, subscribe, like, and send me a comment.